what is going on guys welcome back to the channel today is february 14th happy valentine's day to you guys and your loved ones well we're in minnesota and we're finally getting snow this is the second snowfall basically this winter in minnesota at least where i'm at in minnesota and uh yeah i got the plowser plow we're gonna unbox it and we're gonna hook it up and we're gonna plow my driveway it's about 100 feet or so so yeah let's get into it that's thick comes with straps nice and compact ready to go i don't know if there's anything in here that's empty this one has your hitch adapter right here Heavy duty. All right, so we have it unclipped. These straps, pretty nice nylon straps. This opens up. This is nylon or a plastic of something. I'm pretty sure it's like a hard nylon or something, like polyester. This is good so you don't scratch up your driveway. If you have bituminous or asphalt or you have concrete like i have concrete so this would be nice to not scratch it up and then they're wear they're wear plates so you can probably buy more of these too um, as you go backing is a also a plastic of some sort the frame is obviously steel this goes in this one Collapses like that though. Place bar in open position before use. This one stays on this side, goes to this one just to lock these two into place. This should be one solid piece. Could be under a minute. This is obviously goes in like this, and then that, that weight will hold itself down when you're, when you're plowing. Where my hitch would be if I need to flip it, keep it like that so you can have lower or probably higher. Put this in here. So you could probably go this way if you're too high, but we're too low probably. So we go here, good to go. And she's hooked up and it just pivots by its own weight let's pause the snow you see how easy that was it's just hooking up like a regular hitch it's plug and play for some reason my camera cut out i'll show you i started pulling right here and it worked for about 25 feet or so we have about two and a half three inches down right now of snow but it dragged about 25 feet and then it started skipping because there was too much snow in there um, and then I started pushing right back here, as you can see, and it pushes really well. So let's just go ahead and push the rest of that real quick. And that took 30 seconds. Let's see if I can hit it right. So we had some problems with my camera yesterday, so uh, it's the next day and we're gonna go ahead and try her again. Forgot the pin, of course. Super fast to set up, guys. All you gotta do is take your hitch, put it in like a normal hitch, line it up. Stick the cotter pin in and you're good to go. This is good to go.
but you can see I cleaned it up pretty fast and it was super simple to set up. So there's something I want to talk about. Um, I talked to the owner of Plowser. I believe he's the owner, Ralph. Thank you for sending me this. Um, but he's apparently having customers having problems with setting this up. First, I do recommend looking at the instructions if you don't know what you're doing. To me, this is kind of common sense, but there is a locking bar. You guys saw me do it earlier in the video. This is a locking bar. Some of the people are leaving it unlocked and then this is flopping all around and closing and opening. You gotta put the lock bar in here, guys. There's the A-frame. This is supposed to be pinned. And then there's this lock bar. So this doesn't close or sandwich or break down when you wanna store it. So you gotta put the lock bar in, put the pin in, put the cotter pin in. And when you're done, you can take this off and fold it. First, you're gonna to wanna to drop the hitch. Take that off. Now that's unlocked. Put this back in for storage. You can leave this in if you want to. Take it off. I don't want it to rust. Take these two pins out for storage. Take this pin out. And then take this lock bar pin out. Use it over here to keep it in place. These two arms from the A-frame flopped over. There's a little locking area for that too. I'm gonna put this pin here. And then we undid the lock bar. So now, this can just fold up. Now it's like a suitcase. I almost bring it home. Bring it home. Nice and folded up. You can store it somewhere else, put it on the table, put it underneath the table and you're workshop whatever the case is yeah thumbs up as you guys can see all the snow has melted it is a day later and it got warm enough that that thin layer of snow that the plow did miss all melted you could throw down salt or whatever the case is so yeah the thing worked really well the plow worked really well and uh yeah i forgot to mention guys there is a discount code in the description below and a link that'll take you right to the website where to order one of these use my discount code the first 20 people that uses it i believe gets 10 percent off so take advantage of that guys um but yeah that's it for this video guys and uh i'll see you guys in the next one later